For generations, school children everywhere have been taught that the four letters on the dreidel stand for the four Hebrew words, meaning a great miracle happened there, referring to the miracle of Hanukkah there in the land of Israel. My name is Joshua Holo, and I'm the dean of the Jack H. Gerbel campus of the Hebrew Union College Jewish Institute of Religion. And we have a problem, because it doesn't make any sense when you play the dreidel game. Yes, it's true that when you land on Gimel, meaning Gadol, or Great, you get to collect the whole pot for yourself. And that kind of makes sense. But wouldn't it make more sense when you land on Nun, meaning Nace, or Miracle, to collect the whole pot? And the other letters, He and Shin, make no more sense than the Nun. So we've referred the question to our very own Dr. Sarah Benor, Professor of Contemporary Jewish Studies at, where else? the Jack H. Skirpo campus of the Hebrew Union College Jewish Institute of Religion. Actually, the four letters are from Yiddish, and they do explain the rules of the game. Nun means nisht, or nothing, as in gornished. If you get a nun, you don't put anything in, and you don't get anything out. Gimel means gantz, or entire. If you get a gimel, you get the entire pot of coins. He stands for halb, or half. If you get a he, you get half the pot of coins. And shin stands for stell ein or stell rein, meaning put in. If you get a shin, you put one in. So what does that have to do with Hanukkah? Absolutely nothing. Somehow the game got associated with Hanukkah. And when the dreidel made its way to Jewish communities that didn't speak Yiddish, they needed an explanation for these four random Hebrew letters. So they came up with the phrase, A great miracle happened there. That phrase connects the dreidel to the Hanukkah celebration. Geves, wishing you on behalf of the students, staff, and the faculty of the Jack H. Skirball campus. A freilichen Hanukkah. Let's go. Hiya, shop. Let's go. Hiya, shop.